It really helps. Yeah, we like that. Uh, Jill, we're going to check in. Uh, she's at the Oval this morning getting ready for a big old science fair. Hey, Jill. Yes, the Calgary Youth Science Fair here today and meeting some young scientists who have great projects and representing Deer Run. We have a couple of grade five students here. Here. So I have Sammy and Alishna. Uh, let's get a spin, you guys. You've got matching team T-shirts. Nicely done. I like it. Okay, let's talk a little bit about your project. So tell us about your project, Sammy. Um, we wanted to know which brand of paper towel would soak up the best. Mm -hmm. And when we did the project, we used a black paper, a black um, plate, mm -hmm. and used blue food coloring so we could see the water and um, then after we were done the experiment and we were finished putting the paper towel on the on the paper mm -hmm. I mean on the plate okay. we used a fork and lifted up the glass um, oh, bowl I see. Yeah. and so that they could see how much water was left behind when the paper towel was done nice. soaking up and Alicia, what were your results? What did you discover? Um, well, um, here it says, well, at the end we measured how much water was left on the plate. Yep. And we have a graph here. Okay. And um, Bounty absorbed the most. Yeah. And then Sponge Towel came in second. And then Great Value came in third. And White Swan came in fourth place. There you have it. Great information. Thanks so much, girls. Nice experiment. And I like the matching t-shirts. Well done. Okay. And let's meet Ben here, who is the tallest grade eight student I think I've ever met. Six foot four here. And also a scientist. Now, Ben, tell me a little bit about your project and what you were studying. Well, my project is canine cognitive dysfunction syndrome, so doggy dementia. Mm -hmm. And so my inspiration for the, my project is my dog, Spencer. She, lived, she was my best friend. She lived to be 16 years old. Oh, wow. And she showed many of the signs of uh, doggy dementia. Mm -hmm. So, for example, she would wander around the house aimlessly at night. She used to stare at a wall for no reason. <laughs> and so, yeah, so it was uh, quite a difference from when she was younger. Absolutely. So you wanted to learn more about the subject. Uh -huh. Okay. And what, was, what are your discoveries? What did you find out? Um, well, I found out that it's a neurodegenerative disease that affects the um, cognitive abilities of the dog. And I found an interesting connection that um, Alzheimer's and doggy dementia are related. They use dog brains with doggy dementia as a model for all people with Alzheimer's. Okay, right. mm -hmm. hey, interesting. Well, good work. Thank you so much. And what school are you from, Ben? Uh, Calgary Christian School. Calgary Christian School. Uh, schools from all over the city represented here at the Calgary Youth at Science Fair. We'll be meeting some other kids here who have great projects, including a project on where you can find the most bacteria in your house. Tara, Andy? Oh, yeah. I shudder to think. I competed, I competed in that. Yeah? I'm a little disappointed in my dad. He didn't win it for me. He did my whole project. Yes. And we didn't win. Wah, 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 he did a great wah, job, actually. Wind power generator. Come he did. this hour. Stop talking. We have.